Hey there, Julia from Crocoblock is here. In this video, you'll learn how to create a captivating event calendar, or to be more exact, cool dynamic advent calendar. Let's swing into action! To make it real, you need the following ingredients. Sweet Jet Engine plugin, fancy calendar listing, spicy dynamic calendar widget, and a dash of style settings. Ok, so to enable the calendar option, open dashboard, move to Jet Engine plugin, then Jet Engine dashboard, enable the calendar feature, hit the save button. So now we can work with the calendar and create the events for it. For this purpose, we use the custom post type. That's why, follow to Jet Engine section, click post type, then add new, set the desired post type name, Think over what info you want to have in your calendar. For example, I'd like to display the title, date, time, picture and location of the event. To do this, click New Meta field, type in the label name, so here that's the only field we need to change. Then again, New Meta field, date, and here we should change the field type to date and toggle on the option Save as timestamp. The next meta field is time. Just set the label name and change the field type to time. The next is the picture. Type in the label name, then choose the media as field type. The last is the location. Just fill in the name. To save the post type, hit the add post type button. Cool, so now you can see this post type on the dashboard. Move to it. The plan is to add the needed events in this post type. Let's do it. Click add new. Type in the post title, then fill in info. First goes title, then date. The following is time. Choose the desired picture for your event. And finally, fill in the location. Click publish once you're done with the post. Do you remember what's the next ingredient? Correct, fancy calendar listing. To create it, follow to Jet Engine, then listings. Click Add New, choose Posts as a listing source, pick the needed post type in this drop-down menu, set the listing item name and choose the view, Elementor or Gutenberg blocks. Then click Create Listing Item. Here, let's display the events information in this listing template with the help of the dynamic widgets. Find, drag and drop the dynamic field widget, choose Metadata as a source, then Title as Meta field. Duplicate the field and change meta field to time. And again, duplicate the field and change meta field to location. Now I will customize the section itself because I want to display a background image on the whole event cell in the calendar. So click on the section, go to the style tab and click on the classic background type. And now I'm gonna pull out the picture from the post types meta field, that's why. Click the dynamic, then choose custom image click on the custom image again and in the settings choose the needed field. In my case that's picture from this post type. Play with the style and save the changes in your listing. It is as easy as point and click, isn't it? The next step is to move to a place where you want to put the calendar on your website. Find, drag and drop the dynamic calendar widget in the general settings of the content tab. Choose the just created listing. Group posts by date from custom field. Fill in the meta field name, in my case that's date. I'd like to show the calendar from the custom month, December. Guys, I have to do some style changes, so I hit the ground running, just wait for me a bit. Cool, that were minor changes, but the look is splendid. Mind that we needed only four basic ingredients, but in general, only Jet Engine plugin. Anyways, I can't wait to start all these advent activities. How about you? Okay, guys, see ya! Thanks for watching! May the Crocoblock power be with you!